Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a review on the Outre Dominican Curly Style. This style is super cute and this wig was sent to me by Diva Tress. All opinions are my own. I'm going to be telling you the truth about these wigs. Um, and yeah, so stay tuned for more. So this wig is a lace front wig. And as you can see, it's like pretty long. It's kind of like the first one that I have, the Valentina one. If you haven't watched that video already, I'm going to leave the link in my description bar below, so check it out. But it's kind of like my Valentina one, and I mean, I'm a sucker for curly hair. Like, I just love, 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 love curls. It's a lot longer than my last one. If you watched my other video, you can see um, that my Valentina wig was a lot shorter, but I really still did enjoy it. I wore that wig out, y'all. I wore the wig for about a month. And then I was like, I might wanna, you know, switch it up just because I love switching it up. So anyways, um, this is what this one looks like. It's super long and this is in the color DR30. In preparation for the wig, I went ahead and bought a wig cap from the beauty supply store. They're super cheap. I think this was like 75 cents, literally. Um, and then I used my edge control, my girl is not gel, to lay down my edges that are oh so stubborn because 4C is like that sometimes. But um, yeah, this is what the wig looks like so far. Um, I love the color. But as you can see on this wig, it has the two back standard clips and then the one front to keep that wig secure because we don't want any accidents, we don't want any exposures. It has the elastic band on the inside and it has a lot of clips and it has a lot of like clip-ons and clip-offs, so um, it works well. I'm gonna go ahead and get started by trimming the lace off. Um, if you watch my last video, you'll see how I trim my lace off. I'm just gonna quickly do this and then come back on and try this wig on. As you can see, it does need to be plucked. Um, it's categorized or classified as a pre-plucked wig, but um, what I've noticed is that a company's pre-plucked definition is not the same thing as a natural or a plucking that you would want for your own head. So please be aware that you're going to have to probably and most likely pluck and it's not difficult. Um, if you watch my last video, I show you guys how I plucked it. Um, so I'm just gonna quickly pluck this one and try this on. So I was in the middle of pre-plucking my wig when I realized how much I really would prefer some bangs. So I put the wig back on real quick and then I went ahead and I'm just gonna go ahead and kind of de-identify the middle part as much as I can. Okay, now that I'm at this, I'm just gonna take this middle so we've kind of de-identified we've kind of de-identified the middle part. So I'm gonna take this, just a little bit of the hair, like this much of it. Yeah. Take this much of it, and I'm just gonna cut really carefully so I don't not a cutter, not a hairstylist. And that's what we're looking at. I love it, y'all. Yes. This is how I'm going to be styling this wig. Um, I've kind of wanted um, a wig that was more so giving me this bang effect. I am really, really loving the bangs. Like, what do y'all think? Like, I love these bangs. Like, I'm so glad I made the decision. So glad I took the leap of faith and got it. Like, what? So, so, so cute. So this is what it looks like. Um, this is what the back looks like. Goes down to about my lower back. So the length is pretty, pretty good. Um, I really love this, guys. Oh my gosh. I think it's gonna come out this good. That's why I'm like super, super excited. I did not trust my cutting hair ability, but I guess I'm not all that bad. Anyways, I cut off this much from the front and that's pretty much all I'm gonna cut off. Um, because it looks fine to me. It looks actually awesome. So I pretty much selected the color DR30 and the Outre Dominican Curly from Diva Tress. So that's what it kind of looks like on the mannequin. And this is what I turned it into. I love it. And for maintenance, I'll probably just add some mousse and probably just do some finger detangling. But I really don't like to detangle my hair as much. I just kind of leave it alone. Like, just leave it alone. It's synthetic hair. And you don't want to... Um, speed up the process of it growing old or getting tangled and knotted together because that's not fun either. So yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you guys like this bang look, 
um, and would probably end up rocking this yourself or you could see yourself rocking this, um, let me know in the comment section below. And also I will have links for Divas just below, coupons for them. And um, yeah, check out their site and let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you guys think about this look. I'm loving this hairstyle. Like, it's giving me life. It is giving me life, okay? Um, yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching this video. I will see you guys next time in my next hair review.